Hi all, my name is Shini Devakar and I am from the U Cybercare YouTube channel and uh, I have already done a video on how to get a full screen on VirtualBox on the older version and uh, in the re recent VirtualBox versions that got changed out even in the latest Kali Linux it got changed out so to update users on the latest technique or, or latest method to get full screen on the virtual box virtual machines i'm creating this video and uh, so here i have my kyle linux which is not getting full screen now you can see that it's showing only the small box fine so all you have to do it's very simple in earlier versions in the old version it's very difficult uh, mounting the cd like this and then extracting the files from there and a lot of other things are there whereas here it's very simple make sure you install Kali Linux as a standard method which is there in the um, my channel here you can see that youtube.com slash the cybercare fine if you don't know how to install a Kali Linux you can go and get an idea from there and once you install Kali Linux to get full screen you need to execute two commands which are very important first one is apt minus get update this is to get the latest update files from the Kali server it may take some time depends on your internet connection speed let it give some time so meanwhile uh, if you are coming here actually you may also like my other videos you can just check it out here in the youtube.com slash the cybercare and there are some other videos related to hacking and other, some other security things are available you can have a look at here fine and I think it's done it's happening happening working on it you can just skip to the next step actually uh, I, I have to wait here but you don't have to you just uh, skip to the next command meanwhile this goes on you just you don't have to be waiting here yeah it's done now what you have to do is you need to install another package which can give you a full screen view that is uh, virtualbox guest x11 so you can install the package by typing this command apt minus get install virtualbox minus guest minus x11 which could give you possibly full screen fine so this may sometimes require a reboot of the guest which means this Kali actually and sometimes it may require the whole uh, PC restart the guest I mean host machine also so most of the time it will be be configured just by restarting the guest we'll see what happens so I'm installing it so it may take some time you just give it some time if you are having a very slow internet connection it may take some time as it is going to download 48 MB of the files so take some time you can skip to the uh, end actually uh, to the next phase maybe by one minute or 50 seconds like that so you can see what can happen so the commands I'm going to give you in the description section and the related videos also links will be there on the description you can take a look into the description and if you are new you click on subscribe button to get updated videos from the cyber care and uh, if you like the video keep a like and if you have any doubts regarding this keep it in the comment box so that whenever I can I can reply or maybe my subscribers whoever have knowledge on that they can also give reply they are very friendly it's taking some time So if you don't know what to do with the Kyle Linux, if you are new and if you if you're just um, starting with the hacking, actually you can have a look at my channel and uh, here you can actually see multiple videos like how to do information gathering and how to do network security and mobile security related videos, how to hack mobile phones and how to hack Wi-Fi, how to hack websites. A lot of stuff is there. You just go and take a look. And I don't know what to talk else. okay going on going on 68 percent done ninety-four ninety-five ninety-seven okay it's done it took one minute 49 seconds but in in your scenario it may take more and remember if you are having some problems in installing Kali Linux this process may fail fine and if you are not having a proper internet connection also then it will fail 
so please go through that first install car linux properly uh, by having network mirror options actually then only you can do this otherwise you will get failed so take these things into consideration then you will get a proper full screen car linux in your hand to do practice with and also how to install um, what do we call vulnerable machines and uh, practice systems like uh, vulnerable web servers and vulnerable machines you have the links in the description section and also you have the videos in my playlist you can just go through that and you can practice you can do a safe practice without doing damage to anyone else out there so that you will be secured and uh, others will be protected it's doing lot of stuff Initial module for 4.6.0, which is the latest kernel of Kali. I'll try to pause the video uh, to save some time. So there it is. Uh, previously, we are here, uh, here in the initial module actually. So it came very fast after done actually. V box, etc., etc. Files actually fine. We just did this much. Around two minutes it took to do that. And after that, it's doing some things. Uh, this is a part of installation. So let it go on. Yeah, install completed and processing triggers. Let it go on. Do I have to pause again or it should go fast? Yeah, it's done. Now all you have to do is uh, do a quick restart by typing reboot command and by the time it comes you may get a full screen. So if this thing didn't come in the first reboot of the PC, so you should reboot your whole host machine. Right now I'm using Windows 10, right? So you need to reboot that completely. But 80% 80 80 of the time it will give you the result. It's not an issue. So let's uh, see here. I'm having a doubt whether I resumed the recording or not. Yeah, I resumed it, no problem. It's starting. There you go, as I told you, it directly came into full screen and uh, for some users it may give you error actually, it may not give the complete full screen, at that time all you have to do is, what I told you, to reboot the host machine, right? Fine, so I got full screen now, you just see that. So don't get worried that it gave again small box, it will load, it takes some time, let it load. It's taking some time uh, as it has a less RAM actually. It's loading, loading, loading. 
yeah there it is you got the full screen now you can press control uh, right side control you may be having two control buttons in your keyboard you have to press right side control and then F button to get a full screen here see right now the complete Kali Linux till the end actually you can see I'll open Google Chrome sorry Firefox you can see full screen there So like that you can get a complete full screen just by executing two commands in your PC. All you have to do is update yourself and then install the package and reboot. So as you can see, fine. So let's come back to the regular mode. So if you like this video, uh, you may also like my other videos. So please do subscribe in the Cyberguy YouTube channel and uh, that's all for this video. Thanks and bye-bye. We'll be meeting again with another video. Stay tuned. Bye-bye.